people should not be walking around with masks. Let me just state for the record that masks are not theater. Wearing a mask might make people feel a little bit better. And masks are protective. And we but it's not providing the perfect protection that people think that it is. There has not been any indication that putting a mask on and wearing a mask for a considerable period of time has any deleterious effects. There are unintended consequences. People keep fiddling with the mask and they keep touching their face. And can you get some schmutz sort of staying inside there? Of course. You do not need to wear a mask indoors if, in fact, you've been vaccinated. Good that you're vaccinated, but in a situation where you have people indoors, particularly crowded, you should wear a mask. So even if you are vaccinated, you should wear a mask. If, in fact, you are vaccinated, fully vaccinated, you are protected, and you do not need to wear a mask outdoors or indoors. When the children go out into the community, you want them to continue to wear masks. You know, if you look at, at, at children outside, particularly when they're with the family, uh, walking down the street, playing a game or what have you, don't have to wear a mask. The, 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 the pediatric, the Academy of Pediatric, actually makes that recommendation that children should be wearing masks uh, from two years old onward. And you're asking now if your child is a member of your household, can you walk outdoors with your child without a mask? According to that chart, the answer is yes. But the child can't, not to beat it, yeah. beat it to death. Yeah. Yes, yes. Okay. Because now okay. the CDC says, I mean, I think I've got this right. One mask is better than zero masks. Two masks is better than one mask. But you don't have to have double masks. Is, is I, that right? I mean, <laughs> you know, it became clear that cloth coverings that you didn't have to buy in a store that you could make yourself were adequate. And then you want it to fit better. So one of the ways you could do it, if you would like to, is put a cloth mask over, which actually here and here and here, where you could get leakage in, is much better contained. Are you a double masker, Dr. Fauci? Look like you are. <laughs> Let's do this here. Let's put on a mask. Now we're going to take the oxygen or the, the meter again. We're going to stick it just inside of the mask here and let's see what happens i'm just breathing normal oh my goodness look at that look at my oxygen levels now they want everybody to wear these masks all day long now if this was happening on my work site we would have to get out of the confined space immediately because the air that we're breathing is not safe the best way for me to prevent getting an infectious disease and having to have you as my doctor is what? Um, wearing a mask. No, um, no, no. I don't need to do that. <laughs> you, um, if somebody's, I can see they're getting ready to sneeze or cough, you, walk away. You avoid all the paranoid aspects and okay. do something positive. A, good diet. B, you don't smoke, I know. I know you don't drink, at least not very much, so that's pretty good. Get some exercise. I know that you don't get as much exercise as yes, you should. That's correct. Get good sleep. I think the, the normal, low-tech, healthy things okay. are the best thing that you can do, David, is stay All healthy. Right.